hello, world of YouTube. Welcome to a different game for Finnish Fridays this month, this week, for a little bit. Um, you may be wondering, what the hell? Didn't you beat this game already? Didn't you beat Castlevania the Bloodlines like forever a fucking go? Yes, I did. But you know what I didn't do? I didn't beat it with John Morris. I'm gonna give myself five players. Level, normal. I beat it with Eric Licarde. I didn't beat it with John Morris. And uh, I figured since I did the two campaigns of Castlevania 64, and I just feel like it'd be a better thing to do, uh, I'm gonna play through Castlevania Bloodlines. Now, as for why I'm doing this instead of Donkey Kong, well, uh, I had some real frustrations playing Donkey Kong, trying to get it ready for this week. Not recording-wise, gameplay-wise, and I reached kind of an apex of frustration with it. Um, I was getting a balloon for Lanky, which involved um, going through and beating this mini game, or getting these things lined up to activate a bunch of buttons to activate a vent to activate a mini game that was like my least favorite mini game of Donkey Kong 64 and it wasn't working properly and I was like I'm just it's not worth the stress right now so I figured I'd, I'd, de I'd detox a little bit I'd give you guys a break from Donkey Kong I'd take my own little break from Donkey Kong and I'd replay I'd, I'd finish one of the plethora of uh, Castlevania games I need to do because uh, there's like eight of them that I started that I haven't finished because I fucking love Castlevania so I figured I'd, I'd, I'd bring back a classic, one of my favorite games of the franchise, um, the illustrious Bloodlines, the Genesis, the only Sega, the only Sega helmed um, Castlevania game, which I think I mentioned back in my playthrough of that. It was one of the first playthroughs I ever did because I fucking adore this game. I think it's really cool. I love the look of the game. I love the graphics. And I figured John does have some different paths to his levels, so I would just go through and uh, do those. You know what I mean? And this game kind of control-wise is a middle ground between 4 and Bloodlines. Uh, or 4 and uh, Dracula X, which also needs to be done. But I also am going to be doing a big thing with that one uh, when I bring back that one. I'm not only going to finish the uh, the Super Nintendo version, but I'm going to be playing through the um, the... Origi or the original, the like master, the Mega Drive, the not the Mega Drive, the um, the PC version, because I have it now. I have the remaster of it that came with uh, Symphony of the Night, and so I'm gonna be doing that. But in the meantime, we're gonna play some uh, some of this, some of this nonsense, because uh, I need to, I need to, I need to just take a break from Donkey Kong. And you guys know I love me some spooky stuff. I love making spooky content. So what better, what better time to do that than now? Now, a lot of the fights are going to be the same. That doesn't really change much. That dude is in half. What's really going to change is how I get across levels, which is what you'll see in this playthrough. Uh, it's different than your standard... Uh, than, than the playthrough I did of 64, for sure. It's not going to be like where there's full-blown levels that are different. But I figured it'd be different enough to showcase uh, John Morris to uh, do that. Plus, I mean, I already brought back Lords of Shadow once, and I still haven't beaten it, so I'm gonna go. I still need to bring that back and finish it. But yeah, I figured I'd take a break, do a little smaller game. This is only gonna take me a little bit to do, because it's a regular ass Castlevania ass game. It's a classic Vania title, as uh, some call it, classic Vania. Shout out to Stop Skeletons who taught me that term. Ooh. Oh, do nope. Do a little bit of this. There you go. Fuck you. There you go. You're dead. I just because you're already making a way through the first level. I think it took me that long to get to the to the end of it, to the end of the first level in the original, like in my in my playthrough. Like we just did the first episode. So I know it's not gonna be quite as long of a process as it was originally for me. Uh yeah. I just, you guys know. Any excuse I have to play some Castlevania, I'ma fucking take it. I'ma take that shit. I'ma run with it. Now, what I'm curious about is how this is going to look. Ooh, that is gorgeous looking. I'm trying to keep my, my good whip. 
my good, uh, my good. Oh, shit. Oh, damn it, I lost it. I lost it. Now, that, as you can see right here, this is, this is John Morris's signature move. He can, like, jump. That's his, uh, that's his shtees right there. Shit. Shit. I was supposed to probably do something about that. Something that wasn't what I did. I'm also going to be recording for the 30 minutes, so... Yeah, this is going to be a, a quick playthrough. It's not going to be an arduous task whatsoever. I don't know what I'm supposed to do there. Knock it. Ooh, not that. I'm not... Ooh, stop it. Stop. Fucking leave me alone. Wow. That was rough. Okay. What the hell? The hell happened there? Why did I... Why did I... Why did I die? Is it the... Is it the gru, gru, grizzly gru, gruesome corpses? Is that what it is? Oh, I need that. Okay, thank you. That was just a rough... That was a rough time. Oh, damn it. Damn it. Yeah, kill him. I don't have enough. I didn't have enough. It's okay. Come to think of it, I'm pretty sure there is a, uh, a chicken right here, too. What is it? Yep, it is a it is a chicken. It's a wall chicken. It's a shame. Now, I'm playing this on the Anniversary Collection, the Castlevania Anniversary Collection, um, because while I have my copy of this on the Genesis still that I uh, used years ago, I don't have... Um... The, uh, I don't have a Genesis anymore. Uh, there's just some games for the Genesis that I refuse to get rid of because it's, there's some of my favorites on the, of all time. And just on the console. And they're also rare as fuck. And I don't feel like selling them. Because I don't know when I'm ever going to get them again. Even if I have sold some of my rare Genesis games before. Alright. Oh, I, sh I should have waited. Because that's this is, that, is, that was gonna actually do some damage. There you go. There you go. Just do some damage to him. Screw you, buddy. Get his arm off. This boss fight's a joke. This boss fight is an utter joke. Oop! I say that as he smack laid the smack down on me. Laid the smack down. Give me some smackers. Get his arms out of here. He's almost dead. There you go. There you go. Bye. Made it. Got him to uh, die. That's, uh, that's a good seven minutes. It's not bad. Crack open a good, good victory. Big boy sippy for that one. Delicious. There's your password if you want to play along at home. If you wanna. Okay, thank you. Let's go to Greece! Let's see how far we can make it. If I beat, I'm not gonna beat this in 30 minutes. I feel like I'm pretty decent at this game. I'm not that good. But uh, it, I'm, I'm curious to see how far I am gonna make it. And I'm gonna die. That's what's gonna happen to me. That's that's what's gonna happen. I'm getting uh, what, what Han Solo would say cocky kid come on back there you go I'm gonna hit this guy kill him like that get some gold get our long boy need to not be as cocky oof she feels so comfortable with this game you know what I mean? Let's keep going. Now, John Morris is the same John Morris from the book Dracula, in case you were wondering. Which is a weird crossover between this game and that game. Or this universe and that universe. The written works of, uh... Dracula. Which means, you know, Bella Lugosi is in this universe. <laughs> or at least the actor, um, potentially... The, a guy that looks like Bella Lugosi. Brom Stoker. Shit. Shit. There you go. Uh, let's go this way. Oof. I don't like this section. This section is very not fun. 
Although it is easier than some sections coming up. There you go. There is a long fire engine going on out there. It's still going off. They're going all the way down the street. Alright, let's go fight this guy. We gotta do it fast, though. Shit. We gotta do it faster than that. Because he's gonna drown us. He's gonna fucking drown us in his water. Oh, shit. I thought that was it. Apparently not. I should have grabbed that. I'm an idiot for not grabbing that. There you go. Um, what is this? Oh, it's, it's this again. Oh. Oof. Oh, that was a bad move. Also a bad move. Shit. There you go. Go that way. Oof. Oof. Oh, good. Good, good, good. Where's he coming from? He's coming from this way. I'm trying to do as much pegging damage as I can, because this dude actually, he can hurt you. God, don't, don't you dare. Oof. I much prefer fighting the axe guy, but it's okay. He's still gonna die. Just like that. Let's keep going. I could use a wall chicken right about now. Anybody got a chicken they can spare? I'll take it from you. Because uh, I could use the chicken, to be honest. Or the uh, the final upgrade if you're willing to spare that, but I'm probably gonna die here, just cause like we got it though. If I can stay alive, fuck you, Medusas. Fuck you, Medusa heads. Oh, that was scary. Oh nope, just keep going. Just get out of the way. I'm just trying to stay alive. Ah! You know what I didn't do? I didn't stay alive. That's my problem. Alright, let's go. Well, I lost the ultimate, and I lost all of my whip upgrades, so that's cool. I love when that happens. Never. Medusa Head's still one of my least favorite enemies in a video game. Just because they're programmed so well. They're putting the best... Like, if I could, if I could have a Castlevania maker, oh, it'd be over. It'd be over for all of you chumps. Make the best, like... Evan and Tyler have said that I make dickish Mario Maker levels. I would make even more dickish uh, Castlevania levels. Like, hands down. The worst. Because Medusa heads, they're your Hammer Brothers. They're the ones that uh, that really gristle your, uh, gristle your anger. If that made any sense. You know, you could still give me something, man. Some sub-weapon, I could really use something, man. But apparently, not. You're not gonna give me one. So I'm gonna fight this boss. Oh, no, it's not boss time. I thought it was boss time. It is, in fact, not boss time yet. Okay, good. He's dead. Whoa! Ha, bye. There you go. Get out of here, mister. And then... That fucking fart, man. That Genesis fart. It's a farty ass console. Nope. Oh shit. Asshole. There you go. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, I actually got it down without killing him. <laughs> That's kind of funny. And now it's dead, so I can just keep on keeping on. Keep the peace. Uh, yeah, I'll take that. Ooh, or not. Yeah, I'll take it. Oh, shit. Give it a toss. Give it a toss. Give it a whirl. Give it a twirl. Kill that dude. Again, wall chickens. If you got them, I could use them. Hitting all these farts. Bless you. You're okay. Rachel's just chilling. Making dinner. She made, she made some stuffed peppers. Some, uh, she heated up some stuffed peppers that uh, she made the other night. Uh, smells delicious. 
mine have cheese on them. Because I like cheese. There you go. There's the farty ass platform coming back down. I'm gonna do this. One of these. Oh, I need to not do that, motherfucker! I'm not a game over? Okay, I'm not a game over. Good. Just one life left. Oh, this is this is rough. I got cocky. I need to, again, I need to taper my ego. My love of Castlevania needs to take a back seat so that I don't fuck up. Granted, we're only halfway through this episode, and we've already gotten all this shit. So, we've already gotten this far, so... You know, who knows? Ah, asshole. God damn it. I hate this dude. I hate, I hate Quetzalcoatls like this, man. They're assholes. There you go. He's dead. Give him that a whip. Give him that a whip. Give him that a, a, a wizardly whip. Sorry. But I'm actually not sorry. These fucking dragon heads. If I can get the third whip power up, that'd be phenomenal. Honestly. That's what I'm waiting on. Or unless I already have it, and I'm just stupid. Oof, that that could have been bad. That could have been that that could have been a very very bad. You're farting, hitting farts so magoo over here. Just be safe. Be, God damn it! How they just keep going? And now I'm out. God damn it. Oh, they're all dead. Cool. I don't think I'm gonna... Oh, they drained, they drained the water down here. And there's a bunch of bulls. If you could give me one more wall chicken. If you could spare... Just spare a chicken! Just spare a chickeny chicken! That'd be great! I don't really want to die yet. I don't want to die yet either. Diets just don't sound up my alley right now. I'm really loving the food I'm eating in my life. Nope. Boss time. Where we're probably gonna die and get a game over and I'm gonna have to do this whole level again. I remember the last time I fought this boss, it was a, uh, ooh. Yep, this is not looking good for me. Get on down. What are you doing? Oh, yep. That's a that's a game over. That's a game over, and I'll see you at the boss. Because I'm not going to make you sit through that again. I'm not going to make you sit through that again. Oh, I'm not. Okay, right here. Cool. Never mind. I'm just going to keep on rolling. Big wheels keep on turning. You know what I mean? Give this a uh, big old smackle right there. That dude like that. Oh, good. Scary times. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna grab that. Should have kept it at the axe, honestly. The axe was a better weapon against this boss. But you know what? We will move on. We will float on from here. Cheap shot in right there. Yep. Oof. Oof. Come on. Break him down a couple of pegs. Break him down a couple of pegs. Breaking him down. Oof. This is a this is a much more involved version of this boss. Because one thing I do remember about my playthrough is that this boss was nothing when I played him. Just because he was a. Uh, it, I had the ultimate ability for Eric, and so I literally just sprayed the fireballs everywhere and um, decimated this guy. Let's do this. Another one of these. Doing some of these actions. Shit! Mm, shit! It's okay. It's okay. Oh, he's got a bare eye. He's almost dead. Oh, come on, come on. 
There you go. He's dead. He's dead. Yeah. Damn it. Stage two cleared. Ba ba ba. Here's the password if you would like to play along at home. Stage three, where are we? Oh, we're in, uh, we're at, sorry, we're in, uh, we're in the Leaning Tower of Pisa. We're in Italy. Because we're keeping it European. Probably make it deep into this level and then have to give it a wrap for today. Come on. That thing's head is squirting blood. This game is gory. Oh, shit, he's grabbing a, he's grabbing a column. He's going to hit me with it. Shit. Listen, it's all Greek to me, okay? Only this is Italy, so that's really fucked up to say. Damn it. There you go. Oh. Nope. Oh, that was a good good back end. God damn. Oof. Nope. 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 Damn it. Damn it. Say, Eric is a lot easier to move around with than uh, John Morris is. He's just easier to attack stuff with, you know? Just in general. Because I'm not restricted to this, like, this short-ass distance that I'm given. Oh, slow down on the ROM of a Genesis game on a PlayStation 4. So this is this is part of the difference. This is a different area. So with Eric, I jumped up here. I like jumped up here and it was a it was a golden time. But now we gotta go through here. And we have to swing. And do this whole action with the mummies. Very classic Castlevania. Damn it, I meant to do that. He just took his head off and used it as a whip. It's fucked up. Shit! I died. I gotta fight these stupid bird people again. Damn it! Damn it! Fuck these birds. I'm getting out of here. I'm getting out of here. Screw you guys. Screw you guys! Oof! Nope. Okay, good. I don't get knocked back for some reason. Oh, well. Whatever. There you go. Get out of here. Get your stupid ass out of here, boy. There you go. See? That's what they wanted you to do. And I did it right this second time. This is different. It's boss time. Kind of. It's a, it's a big Quetzalcoatl. I'm doing a lot of damage to it with just this axe. He's dead. It was a cheap ass mini boss. Now we're in the tower. And we're already in the tower. Whoa, whoa. I don't mean to go this high. It's okay though. It is quite alright. You know, I can really use the 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 axe again why it gave me the the holy water i will never know but you know what we're gonna live with it i i didn't need that money bag nope i didn't need that at all whatever oh or i could just do that that's that's cool i can just fall on my ass give me that whip upgrade another one right there nope now when i was playing as eric uh, I was doing much better, and this is where I got the upgrade to the spear. Was in this, and again, I don't, I didn't mean to jump all the way up here, but whatever. What are you? Are you the axe? You are the axe. That's what I needed. The fucking axe, man. 
Oh no, damn it. Why doesn't it just fall? That sucks. Well, we're gonna be going without the third whip upgrade. Unless I can find it on the way up. <laughs> I don't need that, because that's gonna be a power up, and I'm quite happy, oh. Nope, I don't know what the fuck that was. Was that another life? Did I just get another life? That's cool. There you go. Whip upgrade. That's what I needed. Now let's go. Let's, let's, let's keep climbing the Tower of Pisa. God, these mummies! They're whipping me with their heads! It's fucking disgusting. No! Don't shoot your arms at me, you magic wizard mummies! I don't need that. I don't need bats, I don't need mummies, I don't need you taking your head off and using it like a whip. That's disgusting. It's not sanitary. Your bandages haven't been washed in God knows how long. Nope. Okay. Well, whatever. I don't want that. I want to keep this. I want to keep this item. Alright. Let's climb the tower and fight the boss. And then probably call it a day with that. Because, uh... This is, uh... This is a lot of the game done in one, one sitting. <laughs> but I'm not mad at that. I mean, I feel, I feel a lot better playing this now. Then I did uh, playing Donkey Kong and trying to record it for today. I'll tell you that much. Like, I feel much more at ease mentally. I don't want that. I don't want that. I do want that. If one of you could just please not do that. Or give me that. Oh, jeez. Alright. Alright. Well... This has been a laugh and a half, I tell you that much. There you go. You ever just get anxiety looking at an image? Because I just kind of got a fleet of that. I got a taste of that right now. Whew! I don't know what it is. I think it's just because I have, like, slight acrophobia. Oh, that! Fuck! Mmm. This is spicy. I love the spice that I'm feeling right now. I don't remember that lasting that long. I really don't. It's okay, we're coming at this with a full health of hair. Only a little bit gone, because I apparently don't remember how to fight zombies, or mummies. Uh, uh, I blended in really well, the background. Yes. Nope, there's nothing there. What? Wow, that was what the fuck? That was uncool. Let's see if I can find anything over here. Any chickens? Why don't you have any chickens for me? I could really use a wall chicken right about now. Is there gonna be one over here? Also, an axe is nice. Much appreciated. Any of you have... Nope. Fuck you too, game. Fuck you too. Let's just hope one of you assholes drops something for me. Just something for me to snack on. Or, you know, just hits me dead on. I'm not going to be able to fight this boss with anything. I'm not going to have any health. I'm gonna be as fucked as I was on the last boss. Wanna know why? Because I got cocky. And obviously, if I get a game over, like a super game over, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna make you guys sit through the progress back where I, where I get to. Um, but I'm gonna have to sit through and uh, get back to where I was in the game, which is not gonna be fun. Because they did not give you infinite continues in this game. They only give you the 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 two. And then you're done. Now that I know that there's nothing over here, I feel less inclined to go over there. Thank you for the whip upgrade. Nope. Axe. Thank you. They go away so fast. I just gotta climb this tower, fight a little guy, and then we can call it a day. That's all I gotta do. 
seriously all I have to do. You have nothing for me, okay. Oh, or, yeah, I can do that. That, that. that was great, that was a great thing to happen just now. I don't remember the Tower of Pisa being this tall. Then again, I've never seen it in person. I just didn't know it was a one-to-one -one size replica of the Leaning Tower of Pisa. I didn't want that. You want to give me the axe back, buddy? Nope, you just want to give me ammo! Mm. Cool. I'm gonna take a, I'm gonna take a quick breather and eat eat my dinner. That sounds good to me. And I'll finish this up and uh, call it a day. Fuck me. God. So I definitely didn't just fuck up by accidentally uh, not saving the game properly when I went to go eat dinner because I had to change the settings on my PlayStation. I had to get back here and realized halfway through this level that I didn't actually give myself the same number of lives to continue. I didn't do any of that. I swear. Uh, I I remember. I know how to I know how to play games properly. Um, yeah, no, uh, nothing nothing bad happened. We're just chilling here at Cedar Rapids, just kicking it. You know? But in all seriousness, um, we're about to make that climb again. Uh, the climb by Miley Cyrus. You guys know that song, right? My, the demographic that watches my channel is well in tune to uh, their Miley Cyrus jams. What the fuck? I was really upset that some of you may have not heard of the climb. The uh, All Star Smash by Miley Cyrus. Um, that was a part of the Hannah Montana movie, if I'm not mistaken. Fuck. Well, you know, fuck me. That's what I get for acting like I give a shit about Miley Cyrus' music. All that would also be great. You know. But stuffed peppers, they were delicious. Delicious. Gonna come flying at me, dude? Flying at me too? There you are. I don't need that. Your C's though. I don't need that at all. No. Why would I need that? I hate climbing this part. This part actually sucks. Damn it. Oh. I got nothing from that, but I did get a C from that. That's good. And a C from that. That's even better. Another one? Yeah! There you go. Oh, uh, fourth one? Flying at me this time? Yeah, you are. And you're gonna give me holy water, something I really don't want. Oh, fuck me. Alright, well. God damn it. Go, go, come on. There you go, there you go. I could really use one that's gonna give me something that isn't a stupid ass item, motherfucker! She did not, she was like gonna do a fire that happened in our neighborhood. But that's important. That's more important, honestly. And it's not in our neighborhood. It's like where we're going to be moving to. It was also across the street. But it's still really important. There's a big-ass fire. Apparently, it was a huge cause for concern. And a lot of people would gather around it like idiots. Just chilling. Again, at Cedar Rapids. Nope. Oh, okay. Oh, fuck you. Fuck you. Yeah, just get out of here. Just get out of here. Oh, fuck. Just leave me alone. I don't want that, so you can keep it. Just gotta be patient. Patience. Thy name is... John Morris. Unless I can do that. We there? Nope. Now we are. Oh, I could use that axe. God damn it. And I could use that too. Well, anyway, we're at the boss. Maybe. What are you gonna be? That's what I need. I need all the seeds you want to give me. Honestly. I could use a chicken too if you if you got it, but evidently. You don't got it, so 
We're just gonna rock chickenless, half health. It's okay. We're just fighting this demon dude. Who's uh just chilling. He's gonna crack his whip tail. Oh shit. Am I just not hitting him? Cool. There you go. Uh, I love I love when I don't do damage to something and I'm trying to do damage to. That feels great inside. Alright, I think he's just gonna do a taunt here. And he's gonna come flying back. Fuck! Alright, cool. Whatever. Are we gonna start here? Because that'd be great. I would love to start at the boss. Yes! Cool, whip upgrade. Even if I just get one. I just got one, it's cool. It's cool, we're gonna rock with this. And then I'm gonna edit this shit and post it. I just gotta kill this guy, that's all I gotta do. There you go. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Fuck this dude, man. Shit. This dude's an asshole. There you go. Trying to do maximum damage. Alright, he's just spinning this tower. How is how's my guy like keeping up with him? That's what I wanna know. And I think it's just him. God damn it, it's just him and his body that do the damage to me. That's it. That's all that does damage to me. Last chance. Last chance. And if I get an outright game over, then that's it. That's the we're gonna end on an anticlimactic note. But I'm hoping to end on a positive note, so that way I don't look like a fucking idiot. Oh, see, I could have done chip damage there. I'm an idiot. Shit. God. I'm the biggest chump burger when it comes to this game sometimes. Just trying to kill him. Oh, fuck you. You jerk. He's gonna come over here. I'm gonna do some damage to him over there. I didn't mean for that to happen. It's okay, though. Oh, shit. Oh, well, or I just die. I get a super game over there, right? And I gotta come back. Yep, so that's a that's a super game over. Alright, well. Come back next week when I beat that boss. Uh, hopefully you're excited to watch me die a lot, because that is gonna happen. Um, but thank you so much for watching. Hopefully I understand why I'm doing this game now. Uh, as opposed to Donkey Kong 64. And hopefully you're looking forward to it. As you can see by how much progress I made. The game isn't that long. So it's only for a couple of weeks. I just need a break from Donkey Kong. Hopefully you understand. But if you did like it, be sure to give it a like. If you want to see more of my music, gaming, and general notary content. Be sure to subscribe. Special thanks to my patrons. If you would like to join their ranks, linked in the description is my Patreon. On screen now are a bunch of playlists. One for this game. For another cast of anything I've done. And something else YouTube thinks you'll enjoy. I have been Vowel Rack. You guys have good day situations. And I'll see you another day.